comes after the Michigan Court of Appeals this month similarly rejected challenges to Trump's spot on the state's primary ballot. While the Colorado Republican Party is appealing the state Supreme Court decision that found former President Donald Trump ineligible to run for presidency, the appeal wants to extend the stay of the Colorado's highest court, which is already on pause until January 4th, the day before the state's primary ballots are to be printed or until an appeal to U.S. Supreme Court is finished. To date, no other court has sided with lawsuits to disqualify Trump, nor has any election official been willing to remove him from the ballot without a court order. Trump himself has said he still plans to appeal the the ruling to the nation's highest court as well. Well, we're days away from a new year, and if you've got a New Year's resolution or goal in mind, Danielle has a way we can help our minds stay focused on success. So cool. Adam, for, question for you. Have you ever heard of a vision board? I have. Oh, have you ever had one? I have. <gasps> okay, well a digital then. One. Oh, I love that idea so much. Okay, I got a surprise for you in just a bit, but okay. for now, let me tell folks about vision boards in case they're not familiar. Basically, a vision board. A lot of folks create them each and every single year. That way, the next 365 days will be exactly, you know, what they envision for them to be. But what exactly is a vision board? Maybe you're not familiar. Well, <laughs> it's basically a physical or like you said, Adam, a virtual board of images, kind of like a collage. And it's comprised of a bunch of images that remind us of what our resolutions or our goals are for the new year. Now, this can be anything that you want in life. Think big. I mean, whether your goals are learning to play guitar or learning to work more from home or learning to cook, maybe buying a new car, uh, saving up for a vacation or a trip, you know, spending time with loved ones, Ones, maybe focusing more on self-care and alone time or hey just trying to have more quiet time I think that's awesome and we're talking anything that you want to spend a little more time on and focus and energy for the new year basically the idea is you can look at the images on a daily basis because the board is supposed to be placed in a commonly seen area this can be your kitchen fridge because yeah I use that a lot or maybe your bathroom or your closet vanity area your phone or your desktop background or your bedroom wall I mean Every time you look at the images on a daily basis, like I said, you're reminded of what your vision for life should be and what you need to do to get there to make it happen. Again, whether it's working out more or having more self-discipline or just believing that what you envision can actually be a reality. It's all about the power of positivity and making mindset shifts. So, you know, just get your goals in check for the new year and get that off your to-do list. So this event that I'm inviting you to is a vision board party. Okay, that means a bunch of people from across the Rio Grande Valley are going to be coming together to enjoy the process of making their own vision boards for 2024. It's all happening at Craft Social in McAllen and all supplies are going to be provided while they last. Plus instructors are going to be on site to help you get creative and imaginative and get those energies flowing. It's happening today and tomorrow at noon so be sure to check it out. You can do so by visiting the website that you see there on screen and it should be a pretty good time for sure. So Adam you mentioned that you've had a digital vision board, board before. Freddie I'm going to ask you if you've ever had one in just a bit but for now guys I want to show you I've actually taken the the challenge before I, I did one last year here's one on my phone because I use my phone like every second of the day yeah. you know like I said the other option would be the fridge because I also use that every second of the day yeah. <laughs> but you know just put the images together on your uh, vision board and hopefully it inspires you yeah right it works. I'm more of a charcuterie board kind of guy <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're going to ignore that board. comment and we're going to ask Freddie if he's ever had a vision board. <laughs> so I've never had a vision board myself, but uh, I've always wanted to make one. So this seems like an event that I could actually go to as, as a vision board uh, amateur. Oh. Okay. Um, you know, uh, I know you mentioned working out, things yeah. like that, of that sort. Uh, but what about like, um, I don't know. Um, things that I want to do at work. Hey. Should, should I put stuff on there like yeah, that? Yeah, you totally should. Yeah, I mean, just any little goal, you know, even, like I said, just spending more alone time, you know, more me time. I think that's beautiful. Okay. Just, uh, what if I put a picture of me in bed? <laughs> oh, my God. Sleeping more. Oh, well, it's good okay. to get sleep. I was about to say, because someone apparently gets like 12 hours a day of sleep. Guilty. <laughs> so is that something I can also put on my vision board? That is beautiful. Yeah. I love it. Yeah. I'll help you get there, Freddie. <laughs> okay, yes. I'll tell you the way. Yeah, maybe yes. sleep a little less than Adam, but you know, sleep is good. <laughs> yeah. Well, I will take that into consideration. The other thing we're going to take into consideration <laughs> is your weather. Take a look at what to expect and what's on my radar right now. Chilly mornings.